Short yardage here on third down. They go big. They play action. And Henry with the catch out of the backfield for the first down. Grable, they reach the AFC championship game. Levis off the fake. Looking for Hopkins. He's got it. Touchdown, Tennessee. Here's a guy who's a great basketball player when he was coming up. And he, he's, he's struggling. He's a, A.J. Terrell is thinking, hey, I'm the one getting whipped around here. Kind of good. Second down back to Will Levis. Caught by Hopkins on the run, and he spins into the end zone. Second connection, Levis to D-Hop. No wiggle when he comes through at full speed catching that ball because that's a heater. He just picks it up, and then he puts it in those. Second down and 10. Levis, that pump, right Hopkins on. behind the defender, and he's got it on the run. Third touchdown of the day, Levis to Hopkins for Tennessee. Watch the double move there. Richie Grant just bites on that double move. You can't do that. Second time we've seen DeAndre Hopkins get deep. Third time we've seen him get in the end zone. 11 games without a touchdown catch for Hopkins, and he's making up for lost time today with the new quarterback. Levis towards the end zone. Got a man. Touchdown. Wow. Westbrook Akine, and it's the fourth TD pass of the day in the debut of Will Levis had been inactive for the first six weeks and now just explodes onto the scene here in Nashville. 18 of 28, 234 yards, four touchdowns. And really we saw the one time on that drive that he's put the ball in danger. Levis out of the end zone, caught on the run. A first down and more to the 35 goes the Andre Hopkins. Now watch the patience of the veteran Hopkins. Look at this almost just lulls this, the linebacker Holcomb to sleep, and then he gets hit by his own player right there. On a first and 15 now. Under pressure, gets it away, it's caught. Pressure again. Wide open and making the catch at the 36-yard line, Nick Westbrook-Akine. With Rush, who just kind of out there in no man's land, I cannot say enough about the young quarterback, Will Levis. Getting pressure, hangs in during the last moment. Fires over the middle at the 40-yard line. That's caught Kyle Phillips. Okay. Try to split Drive them, out. and you got to be able to put this ball on a line just like that over top of the linebackers right in front of the safety here's again the, this arm strength that this kid has and the throw that he can make i love that he stands in on these third downs like he's been there his whole life like what's the big deal tennessee has one timeout down the sideline caught and getting out of bounds there there's phillips again and and peterson what what an incredible job here giving him a good nod there at the top of the route. And I just cannot believe how Will Levis is standing in there. Look out. Gets it away, and it's caught there, Henry. And Derrick Henry. Alex Highsmith came in that time, and Derrick Henry. Yeah, he looks this off and doesn't realize on his blind side this, like at the last split second, he realizes that Highsmith's on him, and somehow, somehow the strength of Will Levis allows him to get that ball over the defense. The ball in its own eight-yard line beginning this drive with play action. A lot of time to throw. Finding the open man. It's caught there by Traylon Burks. Eric Henry, they're going to run backed up inside their own 10. They go play action. Look how that helps the offensive line. Quarterback's able to throw in rhythm. Takes time for that, that route to come all the way across the field. Open, caught to the 36 goes Chris Moore. Defense, they're of course worried about the deep ball, the threat of the deep ball. Safety here, safety here. And because they're so deep, the crosser right underneath Phillips. 
Josh Wiley in motion on first down. Play action. Levis with time throws, and he's got a first down. You just find the curl. Hopkins it sits down to get some pressure early. You can expect Todd Bowles to do a lot of different things defensively. Third down and eight. Here comes the pressure. Levis stands in there, throws, and it is caught by Phillips. Taking a hit. And we mentioned the, mentioned the pressure right before. Another chance of Will getting hit. But he hangs in there and is able to deliver the football outside. It's a man-to-man -man coverage look. Uh, but this is something that you've seen in the first two games. And I think what makes Mike Vrabel feel comfortable. Different from Ryan Tannehill. Pressure's coming. Levis sees it. Rolling right. Throws on the run. He's got a wide open Phillips. And he gets the feet down at the 47-yard line. By Will Levis escaping the pocket. The pressure's been there all day. He's been good with his feet. But a wide open guy. This is pitch and catch. Here they come. Levis feels the pocket collapse. Runs for it. He's got it. Here's Henry Wildcat. They get it back to Levis. Levis going to put some air under it. Towards the end zone. It's caught. Hopkins. Touchdown. So Tennessee with a little bit of a magic trick. And then he's going to take off. And Cisco recognizes it, but how about this throw in a perfect location? Hits Hopkins in stride, knowing that they wanted to feature him in this game. Levis taking another shot, and he gets it to his guy. This time it's Chris Moore. So another long-range bomb from Levis. They pick up 50. A couple deep balls this year, and he just turns around Monteric Brown. Instead of Levis leading more to the outside where Brown is, Levis keeps it right there at the numbers. And then Moore just goes up in high points and make plays on the ball. See Simmons again lined up offensive backfield. They're going to throw to him. Simmons makes the catch. <laughs> and he's in. Touchdown. Levis over the middle. There's DeAndre Hopkins. He continues the streak. Every game in his career, 156 games, he has made a catch. A run blitz from Carolina. Now pass blitz and a nice job by Levis. You saw that pressure coming. And just calm in the pocket. He feels this pressure coming. Look at that delivery. Just quick, on time, and deadly accurate out to the edge for the first down. So this is a kid that really on tape is, is very impressive. Just a three-man rush. Eight back in coverage. And Levis into a tight window. He's able to find Josh Wiley, the rookie out of Cincinnati. He had two high safeties deep, so you know, man, I'm going to concentrate on throwing in the middle of the field. There's that arm angle we talked about, right? That little yeah. side arm, getting it through a hole, through a window. Fake it to Henry. Pressure coming. Levis floats it up there. It is caught by Chigo Conquo. He's out of bounds. Yeah, just coming off the edge right now and watch this. Just feel it right now. You know where your receiver is. That's not even understanding or seeing him. That's understanding where he's at. He back and two guys on the sideline. So there's there the middle shot. That's a pretty good throw to Westbrook Akine. Throw the ball and you see Akine right there. Westbrook Akine on the slant in the middle. Watch how quickly he gets down, puts the ball down, gives it to the official. So they can spike that ball. And a fake to Henry. Levis downfield. And for the first time in the last six drives, this one goes for 19. Yeah, and just finding that soft spot in the zone. You see the corner rolls up and just. Levis off the fake to Henry. Drills it for Chris Moore. I love this. Coming from the backfield across the formation, you're running what they call a dagger concept. You got uh, you got uh, Hopkins running off coverage in the middle of the football field. They fake it to Henry Levis on the move, wide open. Okonkwo up to 30, still going. Okonkwo finally pushed out of bounds. Yeah, they go right away with the action to Derrick Henry and find. Chiga Conco flying wide open uh, over the middle of the field, but really good design. It. Third and five. Levis steps up to elude the rush. He's going to keep it himself up high and hit hard. And with that spot, he's got the first down. Sometimes you need to do this as a quarterback. Set the tone. I'm not sure I ever did this in my life, but he goes up 
and goes after it to get this first down early in the game, setting the tone as a young player. I don't know if you had biceps like that either, man. Oh, no, no, not even close. <laughs> not even close. Today, they fake it to him here. Levis looking for Hopkins as he get the feet down. Yes. Here, one of the best things Will, Le Will Levis has been doing is driving the ball to the outside of the field. Beautiful throw on the deep out here to DeAndre Hopkins, but he's got such a powerful arm. When you have a guy that can drive the, fall, the ball to different... Levis fakes to Henry, looking for Hopkins. He's got him inside the 10. First and goal, Tennessee. Second and goal. Levis to the end zone. Touchdown, DeAndre Hopkins. Well, this is beautiful. DeAndre Hopkins fakes to the outside, comes back to the inside. It's man-to-man -man covered to not give you free access on the outside. Second and ten, Levis looking for Hopkins again along the sideline. Is this one going to be good? Yes! So much cover three that you see, but this ends up being cover two. And there's a void between the corner. Play clock at one, just gets it off. Levis across the middle, presses it in. Tight window there. Throw the pick six, look him, eyes down the middle of the field, set the back foot and drive it to your tight end. That's great coverage by Miami. And there's that, that arm strength that certainly Tennessee fell in love with. Protection holds up for a while. Levis backpedaling and delivers across the middle. Spears makes a catch and flashes the speed. See his pocket presence. Calm, calm. Goes to leave. And now, uh-oh, I got to get out. Backpedal and just a lofted ball to Spears. And there's a make a guy miss in space. Yeah, I mean, that's that patience. Yeah. That's staying in that neutral space. That quarterback coach, Charles London, constantly. Deep drop on first down. Downfield shot is complete. Catch made by Chris Moore, who's still running and knocked out the far side. Right, Lou? Yeah, like, Chris. you're going to see that hard outside zone set up, and here comes that inbreaker. And Chris Moore is the big play threat on the outside, averaging almost 23 yards per reception. And you just see him here, just push it up the field. Jalen sitting in outside leverage. They play clock at two. Levis swarmed, escapes, still alive. Levis bulldozes over Jalen Ramsey is going to be stopped five yards short of a first down but did well to avoid another sack I mean unbelievable play by Will Levis almost does the one thing you can't do and I don't know how many shots you want to take from a future Hall of Famer in Jalen Ramsey I can tell you what Bradley Chubb didn't give up on the play and you see here he gets up penalty sets up the Titans at the 12-yard line Levis Wanted to flip it to Henry in the flat. Now takes off again, lowers the shoulder. Knocked down near the goal line. They're spotting him down before the fumble at the one. <laughs> this is a completely different offense. Levis hit as he throws, but he fits it in. And there's Hopkins making the catch. Still running. They haven't gotten to the ground yet. Finally shove him out of the... And looking for the main guy. That's a nice throw. Big time. This took a big hit. Look at Chubb. He's come close but not gotten the sack. Stood in there and delivered. Hopkins guarded by Ramsey off to the far side. Levis steps up, launches that direction for Hopkins. And an amazing catch is made at the 10 yard line. Affected Levis numerous times. This time from the pocket, delivers downfield. And the catch is made by Derrick Henry, who goes up and grabs it. Vision. To DeAndre Hopkins. See how he leaves him there? Then that allows Derrick Henry to go down the sidelines. It's a really good job. Will Levis threw it to Hop in the first half. He realizes Ramsey's going to peak and rips that ball. Dolphins rush for Levis has time and launches downfield in the seam. Catch made. Ball pops out of the hands of Spears. Brandon Jones knocked it out, but it's spotted at the five yard line, and the Titans are threatening. To review the call of a completed catch by Spears stands took a couple of steps before Jones arrived to knock the football out of bounds at the six yard line and the Tennessee Titans almost two touchdown underdogs the biggest underdogs by far this weekend of the NFL a chance to take the lead here in the final minute of the third quarter runners ball Titans with some up tempo here underhand pitch juggled by Spears who makes the catch and we'll get 
Levis lofts it, and it's caught. That's Brooke Akine. That ball up over him. Watch. Number four goes to the flat. There's another one of those touch throws. From the pocket. Now takes off. Flips it into the end zone. Touchdown. Think of the mental fortitude it takes as a team to not let this snowball. Levis stumbles as he rolls to his right, but wide open. Protection is good, and Levis lofts to Hopkins, who's got it. DeAndre Hopkins galloping down inside the... Th- Quick pitch, near side. Conquo has some blockers. Henry cuts it back, dives and scores, and Tennessee has tied it up with the PAT coming. And look at Will Levis, man. <laughs> good for that young man in this moment. Now he has a right to be fired up. Absolutely. Good for Will Levis, man. He promised his team would fight. You figure you're basically out of it at 4-8. and eight. And the Dolphins lose for the first time at home. On second and eight, play action from Levis. Puts a man under it, fires, and it's caught. Big play, Traylon Burks. Boy, they pick up 39. Well, you got to love this. And really, this should be Jimmy Ward. He's supposed to stay underneath with the cornerback over the top. But Burks comes right out of that break. You see a beautifully clean pocket. And Will Levis is able to just stand tall and deliver with no safeties back. Little movement pre-snap. Could be a free play. Levis fires down the sideline. High pass. It is caught. (laughs) Westbrook and Keenan. This is good for 33. Well, brilliant use of the hard count. And then this is the flaw. Look at how many of the Texans, they stopped playing up front. And so then they stop playing up front. Levis has all the time in the world. He understands he has a free play, and he throws it up, knowing that nothing could go wrong. And West Eugene, like, on the same page. We share the same brain, yeah. Levis keeps it himself, and he bangs it in. Touchdown. Boy, the confidence level of this young quarterback, you can feel it rise. But then he sees the pressure come off come off of that side. And look, and then at the last second, I think he just follows Derrick Henry. I don't believe that that is designed. And then Spears doing the rest to get the first down. You know, he was huge in that game Monday night. Levis back to the air, slings one over the middle, and it's complete. Well, listen, uh, uh, Levis has been aggressive, and this is the second time on the same route to Traylon Burks. This is the common denominator here that I see. There's no pressure up front. Look at the pocket. And you give Levis that much time with his talent. Tim Kelly dial up here. Levis from the gun, looking, feels the pocket muddy, rolls out. He's going to run. Levis taking on hitters, and he's got a first down. Levis is his instincts. He feels Grenard. They run a game, so they're chipping. And Grenard runs the game, and so now he knows I can just get outside. So to just have the presence in the field, to have his eye. Here come the Texans on the blitz. Levy somehow gets it out. They're going to have a chance with oh, Okonkwo. Boy. First down. Excellent pocket work by Levis. They come on a blitz. And Grenard, the sack leader for the Texans, has him dead to rights. But that subtle little movement. And then how about Okonkwo? He gets tackled or contacted short of the first down. But the extra effort. And he's able to pick up that first down. So tough. It's completely one-dimensional by smothering Derrick Henry. Levis protected well again. And this pass is on Muddy. Second and seven from the Texans, 43. Levis fakes the hand, pulls it back, and delivers a strike to Hopkins. A really good use of the play action to get the linebackers to move to the left side. Really kind of a challenging play for Levis, who has to fake Uh, to his left side, and then turn and throw to the right side. Pressure from Stingley. Levis on third and eight. They protect him again, and he delivers a strike. In this game situation. Levis buys himself some time. Dangerous pass. (laughs) It's snatched out of the air by Chris Moore. Holy smokes. They pick up 23. Had it more come down with that football. Well, as Dalton Schultz did it earlier, this, you know what? 
In my day, they used to call it Moss, but now the kids, the kids say he got head top. <laughs> Chris Moore.